Well, folks, buckle up. It looks like Fulton County Judge Scott McAfee is prepared to hand down his ruling on the motion to disqualify Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis and lead prosecutor Nathan Wade in the case involving former President Trump and multiple defendants. How do I know this? Hang on, folks. We're going to get into all this in just one second. My name is Brian Trippett. I am your front porch conservative. Step on up to my electronic front porch and let's talk. At the recording of this video, it is almost midnight on Thursday, March 14th. About three hours earlier, news broke that Fulton County Judge Scott McAfee, who is presiding over the RICO case against former President Donald Trump and multiple defendants, is now prepared to rule on the motion to disqualify. Now, for those of you who maybe have been keeping up with what's going on, Several weeks ago, a motion was filed before Judge McAfee to disqualify Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis and lead prosecutor Nathan Wade, who we lovingly refer to as Drama Mama and Lover Boy, from the case against Trump and the other defendants on the grounds that there's conflict of interest. Well, the judge took all information under advisement, evidentiary and arguments, and said he'd be prepared to rule in about two weeks. Well, Video has surfaced, and it looks like the judge is going to be true to his word. Folks, do me a favor and take a listen to this. What can you tell us about the timing of your order on the Fulton DA disqualification issue? So I made a promise to everybody. Uh, these kind of orders take time to write. I need to make sure I say exactly what I want to, and I plan to stick to the timeline I, I gave everyone. So this week? Should be out tomorrow. Just okay, you heard it from the judge himself. This ruling will be out on Friday, March 15th. Now, in terms of when that's going to happen, don't know for sure. If I had to guess, I would say it's going to be sometime before noon, but it's up to the judge. It's entirely up to him in terms of when he releases the ruling. Now, my part, I think he's going to rule to disqualify them because remember the standard in Georgia, you either have to be able to show that there's a conflict of interest, or that there is the appearance thereof. And based on the preponderance of evidence that the defense counsels for Trump and others have brought forward before Judge McAfee, oh yeah, they've met the standard of proving at least the appearance of impropriety. Now, I could be absolutely wrong about this. It may very well be that the judge says, no, nope, not enough, keep moving forward. Which, by the way, that decision could be appealed. So we'll see what happens. But for sure, it looks like the decision is coming out tomorrow, barring something that I don't know or some surprise that the judge is going to throw everybody. Now, just to let everyone know, regardless of what time of day the decision comes out, I will more than likely do a live stream in the early evening on Friday the 15th to go over the results and see if we can break down some of what we find. So keep your eyes open, folks. Tomorrow is going to be one more momentous day, as most, if not all of them, have been so far in 2024. Anyway, that's what I know at this moment. But what do you think about what I know? As we start to wrap up this video, please do me some favors as always. Number one, if you're not a subscriber to my channel, please do so. Number two, hit the bell for notifications. When moments like this come along, I want to make sure you are always aware when new videos, new live streams are coming out. Number three, leave a comment below. Number four, share it around. And finally, give me a thumbs up. My name is Brian Trippett. I am your front porch conservative, and I will see you next time.